of my God to love my every wish and the person I want to grow old with. I love your sense of adventure and how you always brighten my day and that you never stop me from going camping. <laughs> I can't wait to meet our baby and I know you will be an amazing mother. I love you. I will always remember our first date. I could have sat under the stars with you all night. After hours of all my nervous rambling, I think I even started talking about bush turkeys at one point. <laughs> you were still looking at me like I was someone special. It was the best feeling in the world, and I remember thinking to myself, I don't ever want to lose this person. You're the most selfless, loyal, funny, and caring person. <laughs> You're the only one who can make my bad days good and the good days even better. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, when you pick me up and hug me, any bit of sadness and worry goes away. When I'm with, when I'm in your arms, everything else fades away. Thank you for always loving and supporting me, even through the hard times. Thank you for letting me put my freezing feet on you to warm up. And thank you for all the hours you spend helping me with the horses. Although I know you secretly love it. <laughs> <laughs> I never thought I would find someone who makes me feel the way you do. You are my best friend, my protector and the love of my life. I'm so lucky to have you by my side. I promise to always be there for you through whatever life throws our way. I promise to love you every day.
Stuck in a bottle That never got the chance to touch the sea Just forgot on the shelf No wind in the sails Going nowhere with no one but me I was one in a hundred billion A burnout star in a galaxy Just lost in the sky Wondering why everyone else shines out for me But I came to life when I first kissed you Best me had these arms around you Can make me better than I was before Thank God I'm yours I was a worn out set of shoes 
wander in the city street Another face in the crowd Head looking down Lost in the sound of a lonely melody An empty pocket set a roulette Always landing on a lost bed Just live for the spin Hope for the wind Go all in Just to lose again But I came to life When I first kissed you The best me has his arms around you You make me better than I was before Thank God I'm yours The worst me is just a long gone memory Heartbeat inside of me You make me better than I was before Thank God I'm yours oh. I was a boat stuck in a bottle But never got the chance to touch the sea when I first kissed you The best me had his arms around you You make me better than I was before Thank God I'm yours The worst me is just a long gone memory You put a new heartbeat inside of me You make me better than I was before Thank God I'm Without a 
sea Or a song without a melody I don't know where I'd be or what I'd do Cause I was made for you Tiny shoes are made for tiny feet My two arms are made for where you sleep The sky was made for the moon and the stars You were made to steal my heart And I was made for you Yeah, I was made for you headstrong, um, confident, uh, hard, like, no, he makes pretty much anything happen that he puts his mind to. The only thing I can think of that he hasn't made happen um, that, he, that he really wanted is when he was a kid, all he wanted was a pet seal. <laughs> so maybe when, they, maybe when they buy their farm, they can put a lagoon in and get, get his pet seal. So, Have you seen by the <laughs> Yeah, just like you. <laughs> Um, so obviously when he set his eyes on them, he was going to do whatever he could to make sure that he, um, he could spend some time with her. So what you probably don't know about Matt is he's quite the romantic. So I think he, he was out in the backyard picking some of mum's flowers to, to take on a date. And they, they ended up at a, a moonlit lighthouse in Byron, so pretty good first date. Um, um, so their, their relationships, uh, you know, it's been five or six years, they've had some challenges. Em uh, lived overseas for 
period of time. Matt still to this day um, works, you know, away three weeks out of the out of the month, which would be challenging and a strain on the relationship. Uh, and Matt is also horrendously allergic to horses. <laughs> so yeah, they've, they've had some challenges. And all while they live in the shoebox down the back. <laughs> they do a pretty pretty good job. So um, a couple of years ago, they started an, a new journey. Um, with the joint mayors of uh, Warwick after buying 375 houses out there. <laughs> and uh, hopefully they, they find a farm that they can call home uh, in, the, in the future. So they're just about to embark on the biggest journey um, of all, which is obviously marriage and um, parenthood. So we just want to raise a toast to Matt and Em. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah, my speech is not going to be anywhere near that good, but <laughs> on behalf of us Bride fans, we would just like to congratulate Matt and Emily and wish them all the best for the future, and yeah, congratulations. Um, Kate would like to say something. <laughs> Emily for about four years now and every bit of my time with her has been so enjoyable. She is a fun, kind person with a heart of God. She has always been there for me and we have shared many memories together. I remember back when she, we first met and Emily was telling me about her boyfriend at the time, Matt. He was everything and more of what she said. He always makes us laugh even during the stressful times. I know these two will last long with a strong bond they share and I hope you guys are the very best in your journey as well. Oh. Hi, I'm Anne Snell, and I'd just like to congratulate Anne and Matt, and, oh, and just with everyone before that, um, look, we really couldn't have done it today without everyone's help, so I know that, you know, they've thanked everyone, but thanks guys, we couldn't have done it without you. Um, and I'd like to, like, it's really good to see that they've got so many wonderful friends and family that have come to show their love and support for them today, so thanks guys. And Charles and I, we couldn't be more proud to have found another son, and we think very highly of Matt and respect him oh, yeah. and appreciate everything that he really does do. Peter and Robin have raised a really great young man. And, um, Matt has always been a part of our family ever since he walked through our front door and into our home and that was six years ago and I remember that afternoon and when Emma walked in the house she goes, oh mum, this is Matt and I just thought, oh how cute, she must have a boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> and it was, it was a really special moment for me and, and a really beautiful surprise actually and also at the same time I was going through chemo so it was a beautiful surprise. And, um, and, you know, it's been very precious for us to watch, you know, observe and then that's commitment to one another over these last six years. The way they treasure one another, laugh together, especially in the way that they support one another, especially with all the ups and downs that life has to offer. So that's really enriched our lives. And just the other day in the house, um, Matt, had lift, Matt, Matt lifted Emma up and was flying through the house like Superman. And they're there laughing and, you know, they their laugh, I was laughing. And I just thought, how cute, you know, you don't get to sort of see these sort of things. And yes, there are psycho moments as well. But, <laughs> <laughs> real, you know. And I uh, was like, I like my daughter, but for Matt and Charles cope very well. <laughs> We're really glad that Em has found someone who loves her as much as we do. And I know the two of them will make a great life together. So congrats guys to good health and happiness.
Some big, big plans. Little, little house out on some hand-me-down land. 